Food has always been my passion. But the truth is, even in the world's best kitchens, the tools can really make or break a chef. That's why I've developed this incredible, innovative line for HSN. It makes the prep easy, and it also makes the cooking a whole lot of fun. From my kitchens to your tables. <laughs> Let's turn the everyday into gourmet. Hey, you're watching HSN. I have just a blockbuster day today. I've been so lucky. Yeah, Dolly Parton last hour. Hey, stay on the line if you can. Go to hsn.com and you can see her brand new scent, Smoky Mountain. I know we've been pretty busy and that little three-piece kit, but now, oh my gosh, I got to pinch myself. I have world-renowned chef Curtis Stone joining us for two hours. He has the most successful uh, cookware line here at HSN. Tons and tons of five-star reviews. I'm going to give you guys a sneak peek before we show you the cutest today special, but this is coming up. Now, look little heads up, we think this is gonna sell out way before we actually get to the presentation. Here's the, th here's the deal. You are talking about these really unique set of three pans, and you can even see the shape's a little different. The size on this, let me give it to you right now because I don't want these to sell out before you know. You are getting an eight inch, a 10 inch, and a 13 inch fry pan. These are all three fry pans. I love little helper handles. Uh, we have a choice of a couple different colors. We have the blue slate left. We have the cherry. And the classic blue, so the black sold out. Okay, so we have three colors left. Look at the price on this, guys, $39.95. You can buy one of his pans with his Dura nonstick. They're just fabulous pans for less than that price, let alone get all three. So I just wanna give you a heads up on that. Also, come on, are we gonna preview one more item? Oh, we're just doing that one? Well, it looks so good, I kinda wanna talk about it. Can I just show, a little sneak peek, come on, come on. Look at this, yum. That's all I can say is yum. That's your preview, it's coming up. <laughs> All right, now, in fact, we do have an incredible today's special times two. It's something he's never done before. So let's jump into it because it's all about food and a whole lot of fun. Okay, so this is a first, a very first. I was so excited to get to do this and it's been crazy popular. I think we're over, what, 30,000 sets sold today? Oh, I'm behind, 32,000. That was just a couple hours ago. All right, guys, so here's what you can do. This is breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks all done in a machine that makes everything so much fun and delicious. And this is brand new. Curtis has never, ever done this before. What you're looking at is a set of two. Everybody gets two of the two-pack, five-inch stuffed waffle makers with the recipes included. So when you see this, understand, it's $20 a gift for the gift exchange, the teachers, for everybody in your family. This is the time to stock up. Now I'm gonna go over the colors, and of course we're gonna get Chef joining us here in just a second. First choice, of course, is gonna be your black up here. This is called the cherry color. So we have, everybody gets a black, and then you're picking your second color. So this is two black, up here is black, and then that's gonna be your cherry. The next one's gonna be black with this really deep, almost beet red. My favorite, my, I'm going to ask Curtis this too. My favorite is the black. Look at the gold. And it's a real gold color. Oh, of course, there's only 2,700 left here. But look at how awesome that fancy gold metallic is. Isn't that fun? The next one behind here is called black. And this is a stone gray, so very neutral. This is black with classic blue. Down below, we have black with turquoise. So this is two different shades of blue, and that's definitely a real turquoise color. Over here, we have black with yellow. That's just sunny and fun. Black with lavender for my purple girls and guys. And then we have black and white. And this is a really good choice, only because it doesn't matter which interior kitchen color anybody decorates with, this is gonna work awesome. So I would probably go for the black and white. All right, well, let me tell you a little bit about Chef. I don't really have to tell you too much, because everybody knows him. Not only is he award-winning, he's He's just been on television for many, many years. He has beautiful restaurants. His butcher shop is amazing as well. Uh, it's Curtis Stone, and we love him. Our favorite chef from down under, he joins us for two huge hours. <laughs> chef, it is so, good, so good to, to see it. you. You too. Happy holidays. I can't believe we're saying that already, but it is here, ladies and gents, and this is guaranteed to arrive before then. It's such a fun little product. Now, it is a waffle iron, right? And we've all seen waffle irons before. I didn't invent them, but we did modify it, and we did, I think, improve it. What we've done is we've put... Let me put it down so I can show this to you. We've put this beautiful little ring in there, and what that ring does is effectively extend the thickness of your waffle, and it enables you to actually stuff it, right? 
It's such a fun thing to do. I have my whole family in the kitchen on weekends. Sunday mornings is a whole lot of fun. You do sweet, you do savory, everyone's got their favorite. It really brings the family together in the best part of the, the house, which of course is the kitchen. Let me show you how you do it, because it's very, very easy. First of all, you turn it on. That's it. You just plug it in. You can see it builds up a little bit of steam in there while it's preheating for a minute or two. Pour your waffle batter in, and that's as much as you need to pour in to begin, and then stuff it with whatever you want. I've got some raspberries here done in like a little bit of a caramel sauce, so I just push those in. You could use pears, apples, bananas, Nutella, you name it, and you can stuff it. Then you pour a little bit more of that batter over the top. You can use a store-bought batter, um, you know, the, the mixes, the, the pre-max mixes, or you can you follow one of my recipes, and we're sending you home with 24 of them. This is what happens. Eight minutes later, and that is as long as it takes. You can see that perfect browning on both sides. The outside becomes very, very crisp. And, of course, look at the thickness of that gorgeous <laughs> stuffed waffle. Suzanne, get ready. You are about to scream. Wait until you see this. What is it? What did you make? Oh, oh. yes. So that's the caramel raspberry um, that we, yes. we just put in there. Have a look at how steamy and soft and moist and juicy and beautiful it is inside. And the outside, of course, is so crisp and wonderful. And watch this. When you plate it up, I say you put a couple up and a couple down like that. You always need a little bit of whipped cream. Okay, I put that right there in the centre. So and cool. then you can put whatever syrup or sauce you want. I've got a little raspberry sauce that goes over here. I've got some powdered sugar. So you can make the most unbelievable appetizers, desserts, <laughs> breakfast items, lunches, dinners. And we're giving you all two of these waffle irons as well as two of these. These are my beautiful little recipe books. And... <clears throat> Have a look at all the fun things you'll be making. You'll be making sweet, you'll be making savory, you'll be making all sorts of delicious things, and everybody gets two books and two of these stuffed waffle makers. So you can get, keep one and gift one, you can keep two and set up your own little waffle bar, you can gift two. I mean, for less than 20 bucks per piece, this is a crazy deal, and the reason we've sold 33 thousand well almost 33 <laughs> almost thousand. I mean, hey chef did you i mean yeah. you're a professional chef i mean you know throughout the world you know you have this amazing reputation i mean you know and i love working with you did you just have a blast when you decided you guys were going to create this was this really fun for you as a professional chef so so fun because you know to me Family is everything, and getting in the kitchen with the special people in your life is everything. And when I first brought home the very first sample, I showed it to my kids, and they're like, what, what can we do? Can we, can we add bananas? And Emerson, my little guy, loves Nutella. Can I put Nutella in there? I'm like, yeah, of course, let's try it. And we just keep trying these new waffles. And then, of course, we did some for the adults, too. Like, I mean, have a look at this one. This is my everything bagel, or my take on an everything bagel. Oh, you can see the crispiness. Stop. I've put that beautiful spice of the everything bagel. We've stuffed this, actually, with a little sour our cream, uh, cream cheese, I should say. Have a look. Oh, please. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. And then, and then you're, you're going to serve That's it. So look great. at the plate here we've done. Smoked salmon, a little bit of tomato, yes. cucumber. Of you know, course. your imagination will just go crazy, and you'll be serving this all the time. Beautiful, beautiful food. And the most delicious um, thing of all is you're in charge. It's all very easy, too. I'm showing you waffle batters, but let me show you a cake batter. We've done a little, um, this is actually a red velvet cake batter. By the way, these claws will pick it, pick it up, right? But if you don't want to use it, you can take it off and then you can just lift it up like that too. So that's fine as well. So you can see the red velvet marble. We've done that red velvet and a vanilla cake. If you've never had hot cake straight out of the oven, you haven't lived. It's also incredible straight out of a waffle iron because it gets crisp on oh, the outside and beautiful and, and fluffy and uh, steamy and delicious on the inside. And then I'm going to pour just a little bit of frosting over the top. And when I say a little bit, you know me, Susan. I'm going to lie <laughs> yes, and it's going to be a lot. Love it. <laughs> <laughs> That's Doesn't great. That incredible? I love it. Can I show you this cute one I have in front of me? And it's funny, whoever had this book actually marked it as their favorite. I love that. So I opened it up and they had it, they had it tagged, right? Check this out, guys. This is birthday cake waffle puffs. Now, can you imagine having the next birthday party? And you know, Chef, you were talking about kids and you've got to, uh, your family's yep. just absolutely beautiful. But can you imagine how much fun would this be to serve these instead of a traditional birthday cake, which is like so boring? Put a couple candles in them, have them blow them out. But every kid 
gets their own fabulous waffle oh, yeah. birthday cake pops. I just thought that was so clever. And here's the thing, when I started so the show, Chef, I said breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks. And people are like, it's a waffle yep. maker. As we continue on, you guys are gonna see, we have a brie that would be an amazing, oh, yeah. amazing, and I'm gonna open it up in a few minutes, so, but amazing item to serve at a really nice holiday party. So Chef, it really absolutely. can be very playful and fun, or you can really do some sure serious can. flavors with this. You can. I mean, look, one of my favorite things in the world, everyone that knows me knows this about me, is leftovers. I love leftovers after the holidays. And look at this. I've got little slices of leftover turkey meat going in. I've got a little bit of cranberry sauce. And have a look. Be generous with it. Put a big old dollop of that and just spread it around just a little bit. You can even take some leftover pieces of stuffing if you want, and you can toss that in there as well. So think about it. Up until a couple of days ago, we probably all had a fridge full of leftovers from Thanksgiving. It's about to happen again for Christmas isn't it so go ahead throw that um, batter over the top and then you just close the lid come over here with me Dave because I want everyone to see this is the holiday leftover waffle look at it crisp on the outside just pull that cage apart it'll fall straight on through you can see the thickness that you're able to get right and that's so with fun. your sweet and your savory this is the leftover because no one wants to just eat leftovers the way they are but look at that I mean, it's such a delicious, delicious way of serving your leftovers. Your kids won't even think of them as leftovers. And of course, you can then dress them up however you like. I'm going to put a couple of these um, down just like that. I've got a little bit of leftover gravy. Oh, by the way, mashed potato. You can go ahead and you can put an egg yolk into that mashed potato or a whole egg is fine as well. And then you can just mix that up and just do, and you end up with these crispy little mashed potato waffles. There's so many options we've actually put together a book with 24 different recipes you're taking two of these home so one for you and one for your friend that you're going to gift it to um, if it's a secret santa that's great because everybody gets a book with their waffle maker in fact vanessa let's show the boxes we've done them in gift boxes for you because we want you to be able to stick a bow on it and then gift it to your friends thanks so much ness um, and you can see it right there this is how it's coming to you guys so you know for that um person that maybe you forgot about uh, guess what? An eight-year-old <laughs> kid would love this, and so would a 96-year-old hey, lady. Did, Everybody would I have a question, Curtis. Love. Did you not have enough wrapping paper yeah. for the one? <laughs> <laughs> we only did a stripe. Well, this is wrapped by a man. This is how oh. us men uh, wrap, not very well. I'm but, surprised you, know you didn't what? take you foil and just wrap it in foil, really, <laughs> if a guy wrapped it. Well, look, you think this is funny? Come with me, Susan. I mean, check this out. What'd you do? This is done. This is the butcher's paper that we use. This is how okay, we wrap the meat in, in the butcher's clever. shop. Okay, that's super clever. I <laughs> love that. Isn't that cool? <laughs> that's really cute. <laughs> All right, guys, so let me give you a quick update. Um, I, you know, Curtis, I gotta let you know, Chef, um, if you guys mm. want this set of three pans, and I know his team has prepped a whole lot of things for all the things we have in our two hours, you might not need any of the demos because these are almost gone. We only have 1,000 left. It's a set of three. They're wildly unique, and of course, it's got his famous customer pick with thousands and thousands of five-star reviews on the Dura interior. If you want this option, there are 20 left. This is called Blue Slate. Then I have the Cherry Red, which is always popular, and we have a classic blue, but I will give you a little heads up, Chef, and your team, that that's going to be probably kind of a truncated presentation. Just a little FYI. I got to show you guys this one because I was talking about dinner as well, and, and they were like, okay, you get one to demo. I'm like, really? Twist my arm. <laughs> I get to eat something from Chef. Okay. But I loved this. That that expandability is really, really clever. I'm gonna move it over here, and I can already smell when the Chef was talking about savory. This is, what'd you guys do? I think we did chicken, right? Is it chicken and waffles? Oh, how cool is that? So the fried chicken inside. Hello, Yum. hello. And then what they did on top of it, you know I'm gonna take a bite of this. Oh yeah, let's just do some really great gravy. Oh, that's lovely. Okay, Chef, oh, that is hallelujah. such a great idea. So fun. Oh, you go ahead and enjoy it. Now, I'm holding up my three pans. I'm a little sad we're not going to do a full demo because Matt's over there making pizzas oh, man, in fun. the 13-inch. You get the 13-inch, the 10-inch, and the 8-inch for less than 40 bucks. It's $13 a pan. I made you paying $13 for that. Free shipping and handling. Anyway, we'll get to that in a moment oh, if chef. it's not sold out before we get there. Um, here's the Nutella. Um, and, and banana. Are, are you enjoying that, Craig? That oh, uh, beautiful waffle. Oh, my Check God. So good. Well, this one's Emerson's favorite. This is my youngest son. He likes bananas and he loves Nutella. 
And uh, yeah, I understand why it works so well in a stuffed waffle, you guys. So you can go ahead and cut them up. You can leave it just the way it is. Crispy as crispy could be on the outside. <laughs> of course, when you cut into it, that is just fluffy and delicious. Oh my goodness, you guys. It is just so easy to do. So, so beautiful. A little bit of whipped cream goes in there. I've got my chocolate sauce somewhere. Uh, here we go. Uh, that's a beautiful little caramel sauce that I'm putting straight over that one. And, of course, if you wanted to sprinkle that with a little powdered sugar, be my guest. I mean, it's just so simple and easy when you've got the right tools. And this is just a fun one. My boys go and play football, and every single time they do, they come back with all their mates, and then this is what we, we have a couple of these in the kitchen. So if you want to set up your waffle bar, I suggest you buy two. They take eight minutes a piece. This one's actually done with some leftover chili. So again, you just remove that little cage. Have a look at the thickness of this, you guys. That's all because of that little extender. And this is one of those products that you're it's like, brilliant. yeah, I just can't believe someone else didn't think of it first because it's such a great tool. And I tell you what, when you've got it at home, you'll be like, oh, why has it taken us years to figure out the stuffed waffle? Because of course it's so much better than a normal waffle. Yes, it's crispy and fantastic, but you can see here, I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of um, this down. Now I finished this, because it's a chili, I finish it with a little bit of cheese. Oh, I've got a little bit great. of sour cream. Doesn't that look oh, incredible? Wow. Oh, you're killing me, this oh, is yeah. awesome. You could use a cornbread um, well, recipe in here as well. I was gonna ask you, can well. I do brownies? Yeah, you can do brownies, you can do cakes, you can do all sorts of delicious um, cornbread recipes work really well. We've even used pizza dough in it and it works. I mean, oh, that's you're, a great you're idea. only limited by your imagination. Well, you know, I it's thought so it'd be really fun. fun to just take hot dogs. You know, if you just serve a kid a hot dog, you're like, oh, yeah, yeah, it's not really fun. But if you serve them in a little waffle, like that deep waffle, it's gonna be a blast. All right, now this one okay. I'm very excited about because I'm a huge Brie fan, I love Brie. And supposedly what they've created for me on this one, sure. I'm just gonna use my fingers, is a Brie waffle so again can you imagine you're having a holiday party how much oh wait that's not what did you guys make me in the second one oh well, i'll just eat it <laughs> i'll find out <laughs> but you know what i love about this chef is it's you know when you're trying to host people and you want to make a real impression mm -hmm. and you're like oh i'm gonna make it fun all this little bite side stuff gets people to go wow like if my friends walked oh, yeah. in and i had all the food done like this they'd be like oh my goodness suze that is so clever or if it's a <laughs> birthday party or it's just watching the football game food is more fun when there's a surprise to it this it sure is now look i've got apples and cranberries oh, right this here great. this is sort of mm. a bit of a take on a pie filling right mm -hmm. then you take a little bit more of that batter you just go over it like that, and then you close the door. It's that simple. There's no buttons to press. There's no latches to clip on. It does the work for you. Eight minutes is how long it takes. And check it out. Look at that gorgeous, crispy oh, outside. And of course, inside, it is so fluffy and light and sensational. There's the apple and cranberry, and it is just so, so easy to make. You will just fall in love with this. Now, I've got a little animation. And I would love to walk everybody through it as I put this down, and then I'm going to try and sneak a bite while I'm talking. Let's see if I'm good enough to do that. <laughs> but I would love for you to see exactly how this is made and exactly how it's built, because what we do, you know me for my non-stick. So, of course, nothing sticks here. This is the greatest non-stick you can get. The beautiful thing about it is um, you just pour a little bit of the uh, batter into the bottom of the waffle maker, then you put your filling. It can be sweet, can be savory. I love cheese in this, especially if you're doing the savory ones. And then a little bit more batter on top. It gets crisp and sensational on the top. And then of course, under, in, inside, it is light and fluffy and sensational. The best part of all is you are just gonna do so many different things. I'm actually hitting this. Uh, this is still that apple and cranberry. I've got a little bit of raspberry sauce that I'm gonna just drizzle around. So that's optional. You don't have to put the syrups on if you don't want. Can we but throw I'll some ice what, cream on one of these? I'm waiting special. for the cake and ice cream. Come on. Hey, okay, oh, yeah, so well. <laughs> that's coming later. I mean, think about it. Instead of doing birthday cake, you do the little pops, little thing of ice cream beside it. Like, you're gonna be the cool mom. You'll be the grandma. Like, grandma, can we use the waffle maker today? You're like, yes, dear. And they'll be like, Grandma's cool. All right, I, Chef, I got to do a quick update. I had the original <laughs> blue. Uh, what was the name of that blue? Slate blue? Mm hmm. Was it um, blue slate? It is sold out. So here's the other blue option. What are we calling this one? Classic blue. And then I have the classic red. 
Okay, so just FYI, I've got those two left, just so you'll know, because those, those are gonna probably be gone before we actually, yeah, there's about 900 left, so it might be a truncated pre presentation. All right, I'm gonna run over colors again, because Chef showed you a lot of different ideas, but here's the story. We have the black and white. I think that's a really good choice if you don't know what the interior is of someone's kitchen. Like, you have no idea, a white or black, they're both gonna work, okay? Then we have black lavender. Everybody gets a black, and then you're picking black yellow. Then this is black turquoise. This is black classic blue. This is black stone gray, black gold. This is my favorite, by the way, because it's really genuinely a gold color. So is that it? Of course, of course, there's only 600 left. So those are gonna sell out here with Chef in this show. Uh, then we have black red. This is actually the most popular right now. And there's less than a thousand here. So if you want the black gold or the black red, definitely wouldn't wait. We have black cherry, and then you can get two that are just classic black, black. And you gotta think about it. If you're there right now and you're like, I don't wanna go out shopping, ugh, you wanna do it online. You want life to be easy. This is a great idea. My son and his girlfriend, they're in their early 20s. They would love to have this. I know in my head they would love this. And then I'll give another one to somebody else in my life. Think about that really fun teacher gift. Like, don't give get an apple and a mug. They do not want another coffee mug. They've got 8,000 coffee mugs. Chef, wouldn't this be the greatest oh. teacher gift? Because your kids are in school. I can't hear you. Oh. <laughs> I was saying, wouldn't it be a great teacher Sorry, gift? Because you've got your kids are in school. I'm sure there's a lot of teachers you need to bribe. I can't hear you. <laughs> oh. it's, it's just so good. All I can hear is <laughs> angels singing right now. They taste <laughs> So delicious, you guys. I mean, the crunchiness on the outside and then that fluffiness on the inside is wonderful. Yes, any teacher would love to get one of these. Are you kidding me? Anyone would. It's the best. They're so fun to use. And they really just have that beautiful spirit to them. There's nothing better than a brilliant family breakfast. This one's made with gingerbread. And again, I'm just gonna remove them. You can use cake batter. You can use the waffle batter. You can even use a pancake batter in here and it still works. The gingerbread, we've gone and put some pomegranate and some uh, cranberry in there. And let me show it to you. Again, I kind of like to mirror a little bit of what I put on the outside on the inside, or on the inside outside, I should have said. A little bit of whipped cream goes into the center, and then I've got this beautiful pomegranate molasses that I'm gonna go straight over the top here. So you can get fancy with it, you can make them sweet, you can make it savory. Look, we've even done this. This is a beautiful big trifle. We've soaked them in a little sherry. This is the waffle corners. And then we've put a, a fruit berry um, compote. Then we've put a uh, cream and a custard in there. So a beautiful big dessert. I'm gonna show you this one and then I know you've got another color update. Here's the enchilada. <laughs> Guys, all of these will sell oh, out by fine. the way. So if you wanna pick one up, go ahead and grab it. There's the enchilada. This is some leftover Mexican food. So I've got chicken enchiladas in here. Cordless electric knife. If, you, if you're watching me use that, we still have a handful of them to go around. Not enough to do a full airing, but it's great because you can use it at the dining room table. Because of the lack of cord, you can use this all over, um, all over the house. Okay, here's that chicken enchilada. There's a little corn. A little bit of that beautiful spicy Mexican. I'm gonna pour a little bit more hot sauce over the top. Finish that off with a little That's bit of great. cilantro. I mean, are you joking? Delicious. <laughs> no kidding, it's so much fun. And food is just more fun when it's cute little bite-sized pieces. Whether it's the party or it's it every day or for breakfast or what have you. I saw this one right here, I think this is interesting. They did like a take on a frittata using just all eggs in oh, this mixture. And a lot of fresh tomatoes, a lot of fresh spices in there. But if you wanna make sort of a morning frittata, I think that's a really clever idea. The other thing, Chef, thank you. He made it so easy, you guys. It's literally plop all the stuff in there, plop this down. You're good to go and chef i assume i can use it with or without the extender the extender makes it a lot more fun but i don't need to use the extender right no you don't have to you can take it out let me show you how easy it is you just lift it up and you remove it like that and then you go ahead and build your waffle straight in there gotcha. i want to do a stuffed one and so the, the easiest way to do it of course is with that extender in but if you don't want to do a stuffed waffle then you don't have to you can make a normal waffle too i remove um sorry i pour in a little bit of that now this is some pulled pork if you like barbecue, if you've ever got a little brisket or a little pulled pork, I know you like barbecue, Suzanne. Yes, I Isn't do, Isn't that, sir. Um, yeah, I mean, 
and then you pour a little bit more of that. I don't blame you, by the way. Just don't put the bones of the ribs. That's the only thing I'll tell you. You pour it in, you let it go all the way to the top. That's it. You close the lid. Eight minutes is all it takes. You come back over here. And, of course, if you do remove that um, extender, then it'll take about five minutes, right? Okay. Because it's not going to be as, as thick. Big. But you want that beautiful thickness when you're stuffing it for sure. This is my pulled pork. I'm going to show you how easy it is to make the batter in just a moment. Look at that gorgeous Great. pulled pork all the way through there. Oh, and of course, the best thing of all. Mix. Oh my God, pulled oh, pork yes. and cornbread. Oh yes, you can make it with cornbread. Hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. I've got a little barbecue sauce here, right? So that goes around just like that. You could use mustard as well. I've got some chives. You could put some cheese on that. I tell you what. That, my friends, is the most delicious after-school snack for the kids or midnight snack for the chef that gets home a little late from work sometimes. You know, I'm just saying. I'm just saying that does happen. Because <laughs> in eight minutes, boom, it's done. And you know what? I like it so much fun. You're showing so many leftovers. Like the enchata. Which, like, right. okay, if you had Mexican the night before, keep the leftovers, and the next day, you're going to have a whole different experience. Here's a great one. Chicken and pimento cheese waffles. Okay, my grandma used to make oh, yeah. some mean homemade pimento cheese. How amazing is this? And remember, this is breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks. Yeah. I think a lot of times in the past, you've seen a quick waffle maker, like, well, yeah, for breakfast, but I really want waffles. No, this one literally, basically, Basically, if you've got it at home, you can throw it inside here because it's got the stuffed ability. That's what makes this one especially fun. And then please remember, especially if you're channel surfing, because I know people half listen, everybody's getting a set of two. So let me show you that once again. Uh, mine aren't even wrapped, Chef. I don't even know what's up with that. But you get two separate boxes. You get two of the waffle makers. This is good. And, and what I like to, again, you want to super, supervise kids. But I like it because, Chef, you talked about your kids getting involved in making their favorite waffle. So be careful because obviously it's a hot electric, but even younger kids can do this and you don't have to be afraid of like them on a stove trying to use a pan or something like that. It's, it is so easy to work with. I mean, you literally open the lid, then you pour in the batter, you drop in the stuff in and then you pour a bit more batter. This is how they're coming to you. Gorgeously gift boxed. By the way, I've got something else that's coming to you beautifully gift boxed and it is right here. Let me go ahead and lift this up. Now, any guesses for what this could be? There's one. Two, three of them. Three pans. Three set. of these gorgeous gift boxes. Yes, correct. <laughs> okay, so imagine for less than $40, you can have these individually gift box. You get the 8 inch, you get the 10 inch, and you get that 13 inch. We started this show with 1300, we're down to 800. We're not going to get to Eric, guys, I'm telling you right now. Yep. Five layers of Durapan in every single piece of cookware. That stainless steel disc makes it extra strong. So um, I love that low wall. So you can do wonderful pancakes. You can do great French toast. So completing that breakfast set that we're talking about right here. I mean, guys, you can pick up five gifts. One, two, three, four, five with the great Today Special. Point. for. Are you joking me? Like, That's... for way less than 100 bucks. That, my math really that is a good. brilliant idea. Okay, in the pans, the set, this is the only color I have left, guys, and that's the classic blue. So grab those. We will, in fact, they even, while I was on the air with Dolly, they're like, uh, we're changing your show up because those pans aren't going to last very long. I'm like, okay. And they're not, clearly. So this classic blue, you can see it right there. That's the color we have left. The cherry red is now gone. I have to show you another one, Chef, because while I was watching you work with this, I don't know why, but I kept thinking, I want to slam a hand hamburger in there. Look at this recipe, you guys. Ooh, yeah. Okay, look at this one. It is a patty melt. Waffle patty melts. Oh, chef, could you do a Reuben in here, do you think? Oh, you sure could. Oh, Absolutely. Can you imagine uh, a Reuben sandwich waffle? <laughs> yum. I mean, you name the sandwich, you can do it. You can do a croque monsieur, a croque madame, a Reuben, a brisket sandwich. I've done a pizza. Look at this. This one's my what? pizza, by the way. Check it out, you just pull the two sides apart. It's that simple. You can see how beautiful and thick that waffle is. Then I'm picking up my cordless electric knife. I'm gonna zoom right on through it. Look at this. All of your favorite toppings from pizza inside that waffle. Sausage, mozzarella, tomato, salami. You name it and you can go ahead and stuff it. I go ahead and I do that. It is the most delicious snack. Talk about that midnight snack that I was mentioning before. You can see how delicious that would be. I drizzle a little more tomato sauce. Totally optional. You don't have to, of course. I've got some chives there. I've got a little bit of parmesan. And you've just got the most perfect little snack so simple and easy to make, whether it's sweet, whether it's savory, I will tell you this, you guys, this will be completely gone tonight. If you wanna jump in 
don't delay. I know we're talking about which colors are going. They're which ones are going to go first. We are on track for a complete sellout. Mark my words, they won't be any left. Oh, this one's my French onion. Look at that crispiness on the outside. Pull that cage apart and it drops right on out, that extender. You can see how thick it is. Now, all I've done with this, I've used a French cheese, Gruyere, and I've also used a little caramelized oh. onion. Look at how <gasps> wonderful that oh, looks. Oh, stop it. I'm going to slap so myself. Good. That looks so good. Daggone it. How about this <laughs> one, guys? This is another. I remember you're getting 24 recipes and you get two books. So each comes completely as a gift, right? How about this one? This is good. Jammy cheesecake waffles with berry compo. Yeah, jammy cheesecake, cheesecake in waffle. Okay, chef, I did want to give a quick update, guys. The gold and the black, my personal favorite, I have 500 left. So when chef said these are going to sell out, yeah, they're gone. Okay, so if you want the gold black, 500. If you want the black red, I have 650. And I want you to see, you know what I'm going to do? I'll pull this beside it. This is the red. It's really a deep, deep red. And this is the cherry. So again, everything's in twos in pairs you get a black everybody gets a black you just pick your other color this is almost gone too so if you want the black red that's very limited now we have black black i think that's also an easy one to pick because you don't who cares black works in any kind of environment right doesn't matter what color that you know just easy for gift giving we have black we have stone gray so there's the stone gray this is black and classic blue like the pans i have over there this is black and turquoise that you see down here black and yellow i think that's sunny and fun a lot of you love purple like i do black and lavender is that option and here's the other one that i thought was real kitchen friendly black and white because black and white will work in everybody's kitchen it really doesn't matter but i want you to think about the kids you have off in college like my son and his girlfriend they would they would really truly love to have this think about that super bowl party how do you wow your company that comes over for the big game or maybe it's the soccer they're coming over for whenever you have this out especially when you put them in the little bite-sized pieces everybody's just going to be so tickled it makes makes the whole environment of that party or even your little get together more fun. It makes a boring Monday breakfast more fun for the whole family when you've got these really magical happy waffles. I think we should name it the oh, magical yeah. happy happy waffle maker two set. <laughs> Isn't it true though? I like you it. almost can't help but smile when you walk up yep. and see this presentation and how cute everything is and how good it is. By the way, they get only perfect five-star reviews. It's a brand new item, so we've only got a handful of reviews. They're all perfect five-star. Same as my brand new mixing bowl set. This is an eight-piece mixing bowl set with those clear um, glass lids, so clear uh, plastic lids, so you can look right on through them. There's nine reviews on this, all of them perfect five stars. We have those available for you. I'm gonna show you how easy it is to make the uh, mix. Now, I'm using one of those beautiful mixing bowls right here. You toss in a little water. This is the box mix that you get from the grocery store. Couple of eggs and a little bit of oil, all right? These are my silicon measuring cups, by the way. Let me show you those. There's one, two, three. They are a set. This is what I've been using the whole way through. They nest beautifully so they don't take up too much space. All right, now back to my waffle batter. I'm going to use my immersion blender. You guys, this, we started the day with 1,500. I think we're down to four or 500 of them. Of course, that immersion blender works perfectly, right? I can just twist it off, though. And if I want to use the whisk, I put that on, and then I'm using my whisk. And, of course, if I want to use my double beater, you haven't seen one of these before, have you? Oh, nice. Have a look at that. So wow. I can go in here, and I can start making that perfect batter. Turn it up a little bit. It's multi-speed, of course, my immersion blender. This is with the double beaters, you guys. So all you want to do is go until you don't see any lumps. Right, so it takes all of 15 to 20 seconds. That's how simple it is. Now, yes, we're giving you recipes, and if you want to jump into that little animation that we gave you with those recipes, be my guest. But that, my friends, is that. That is the batter done. That's how quick and simple it is. You remove those beaters, and you go to making your next waffle, and I think that's exactly what I should do. I'm going to pick this up, and by the way, I just made that. You don't need to rest this dough. You just pour it straight on in, right, just enough just like that, and then you can make, I'm gonna do a PB and J. So I've got a little peanut butter. Oh, stop it, okay. stop yep, it. A little bit of peanut butter. Oh, that's so little bit of, this is again for my beautiful boys, they love this one. Nice. Some, some strawberry jam, a few, a few peanuts in there as well. Of course. A little bit more of that batter. Oh, yes. And then you close the lid. It's that simple. <laughs> you come back eight minutes later, Susan. I know you're having as much fun as we have on up. Sunday mornings.
Isn't it so cool? Look at that. Wait, I have a question though. How do you know when it's done? Because you have little lights on the top of this. Well, the, there's a red light and a green light. Just like when you're driving <laughs> okay, your car. That's easy. When the green light comes on, she's ready. And all you're gonna that's do great. is lift it up. Look at that PB and oh, oh my oh, oh, oh. gosh. That is Isn't so that good. Crazy? And I also was thinking, Chef, on a really cold winter day, can you imagine if you want to do a grilled cheese waffle, like a ham and grilled cheese waffle sandwich, and then do a hot cup of tomato soup on the side? Like, and the fun oh, thing about it yum. is, and you've got to remember, this one has been used heartily mm -hmm. all day long. I know these are our two demo ones that we're using. It's his famous nonstick on the interior. So a lot of times you ever get a waffle maker, and why don't you ever use that old big honkin' waffle maker? It's because it's a pain in the you know what to clean up. His non-stick is the very best of the best of the best, and it's inside here, so things just fall out. It's not like you have to soak this for hours to get it clean. Thus, what does that translate to? You'll use it a ton, right, Chef? Because if you have to, oh, yeah. if it takes hours to soak and you're scraping it and stuff, you're not gonna use it because it's a pain in the you-know-what. But because it's your non-stick, it just comes out beautifully every time. Yeah, I mean, look, there's so many wonderful things about this that you'll love. These are some little ice cream sandwiches. I'm just showing you some different inspiration. I'm gonna bring That's it over great. so Dave gets a good look, otherwise he gets grumpy. <laughs> There's my ice cream sandwiches right here. Did he here. also wrap and the then, gift? Was Dave responsible for the wrapping he, of the gift? He, he, no, I've gotta take responsibility. That poor wrapping was me. <laughs> okay. Um, these are the cake pops, or should I say waffle pops. I love and that. And these are the chocolate cake that we've gone ahead and filled with ice cream. So, I mean, you will get the recipe books. You will be so inspired. 24 brand new recipes. We've developed them all especially for you. Here they are. In fact, let's show the animation because I think you get a better look at those recipes so we don't get any glare on the on the recipe book. Um, but you'll get to see there's breakfast items, there are lunch items, there are snack items, dessert items. I mean, look at that patty melt. Are you joking me? So delicious, you guys. Anything with cheese in it is your friend. Anything with a little caramel sauce, chocolate, Nutella is also your friend. I mean, that's the leftover one. You can see it right there. That's the holiday leftover. A little turkey, a little cranberry sauce. It is just, is that accurate? 36,000, guys, when are yes, we done? Sir. <laughs> if you want this, jump on in. Jump on in right Especially, now. Especially, Chef, if you want the black, gold, or black, red. Those two, right. absolutely. I don't think it'll make it to the end of this hour, and Chef's with me for two hours tonight. Okay, check this one out. How about a molten cheese Mexican chorizo waffle. So again, think about that's Mexican sausage, right? With all that cheese put in this, whatever you want. How cool is that? Put the sauce on top when you're done. But again, all the recipes as chef mentioned are included times two. So you get two separate boxes, two separate waffle makers and two separate rep recipe books. So they're ready to go and it's under $20 per gift. Now I love that because you know what? This season, you might not have a really big budget to spend a ton of money. And you know what? You don't have to give somebody really great quality and that's what chef represents he has this amazing international reputation i mean i tease him a lot that's because i've known him for the last couple of years but the guy's a rock star in the world of restaurateurs and chefs and cooking and all that he doesn't do anything that's like bad like he's only going to put his name on the really good stuff and he only will put his name on it after he's very involved in the development of it what makes this one different guys in case you missed i'll show you it's this right here this is so cool most waffle makers you you just make your basic kind of boring waffles. This gives you an extension. So when you put it in there, it's super easy to do. You can fill more. And now you can do the famous stuffed yeah, waffles really shot. easy with this system. But again, one day, one chance, it's all you get. Think of all the people. Anybody who puts stuff in their mouth to eat, I think will like this. And that's pretty much everybody on your gift giving list. <laughs> so good time to pick it up is right now while we still have so all the choices available. I will guarantee you next hour, we will not have every option available at this rate because we know how many we have left and we know how many we've sold. Chef, what are you going to show us next? Well, I wanted to show you this um, beautiful... Oh, you know what, Matt? Bring it on over. I want, I want everyone to see it. Come on, mate, bring it. Matt's been over here. I said, make me a pizza. Come on, Matt, bring it over. <laughs> Don't worry, just bring it. Just bring it, baby. I just want it. You stick I it bet. down there. Have a look at that pizza. He's run off with my towels. Let me get another one. <laughs> oh, with the pans, the pans. Have a look. This is that low wall pan set. I mean, you can see how wonderful that is. Rochelle, would you get me a platter, please, so I can just go ahead and show everyone that with that nonstick. Hi, Rochelle. Absolutely. There's Rochelle. 
You can see how that pizza's been done. Absolutely beautiful. Crunchy on the bottom. Oh, it great. slides right on out of the pan. We're down to 600 of them, guys. 600, that's, the that's it. Large 13 inch. I've got you the three set right here. Let me show it to you. You get eight inches. You get 10 inches. We're crazy busy on the phones, guys. So go to hsn.com and you get the 13 inches. Five layers of Dura Pan in every single one of them. By the way, we've got a 14 piece cookware set. We have stock pots. We have bake. Go to hsn.com, <laughs> shop that whole collection because it's all free shipping and handling for the entire day. Also, you know those. what, Chef? I know you mentioned this early on, but we finally have his trivets back in stock. If you want to see the best like dish dryer and trivet so you can put all that hot stuff on it, please grab these. Everybody that I know gets one of these for the holiday. And then they start using it. They're like, okay, this is the greatest invention ever. So just FYI, we've got all that available. We do have his immersion blender with the attachments available. This is going to be, of course, his measuring cups and silicone. He has a cute little apron. I think it's kind of the style you guys use in your butcher shop, right? That's available it's too. Yours. So is it? Is that is that uh, is that really authentically the one you're wearing right now? Oh yeah, absolutely. Look, I've put a little towel loop there so your towel's always in place. Nice. For those of you that have my kinetic thermometer, I actually put a little pocket. By the way, you can use it as a spoon pocket or whatever you want. So there's a little pocket right there um, or my kinetic thermometer is uh, is here. I know so many of you Huge. have that. So yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful apron. I love that. All right, guys. So again, we've got all the options available right now, and it is a two-pack. I know I keep re referencing that, but I don't. I want you to, because a lot of people think, oh, 39 bucks, I'm getting a single one. It's totally worth it, because it's got, you know, stuff. You could, it's expandable, right? No, you're actually getting, everyone gets a set of two. You all get one black, and then you're just picking your other color. This is fun for everybody. If you live by yourself, it's a really fun way just to make food fun and better and quicker. It's a great thing for leftover chef. I'm just so impressed of all the leftovers you used inside here to just revamp oh, yesterday's yeah. meal well this is a little bacon egg cheese and um nice. and uh uh muffin uh, i beg your pardon bacon egg and cheese and then we go ahead and turn that into a wonderful waffle let me show it to you you lift it up that beautiful extender cage just comes out you just pull it apart like that Look at the thickness on these incredible waffles. And then, of course, you can stuff them with anything you like. We've done a bricky one, and there it is, my friends. Eggs, bacon, cheese. The flavor of this is like no grilled cheese sandwich you have ever had in your life. The flavor is just sensational. I'm going to grab myself a plate um, and drop that down and show it to you. Have a look at how crispy and fabulous the outside is. And then, of course, that fluffy interior is just to die for. I'm going to hit some chives there, um, and then I'll take a little bit of hot sauce um, or something. Thank you so much, Vanessa. There we go. A little bit of hot sauce on my, my gorgeous brekkie. Gorgeous. I mean, the fun that you will have when you get this home. And the best part of all is, um, of course, this beautiful little footprint. It nests so well. By the way, you can actually stand it up like that. Do you see that? Come on, walkie. Wake up, darling. <laughs> <laughs> you can see how you can just stand that up and it just takes up no space whatsoever. Hey, Chef, can and you then, show course, the cord keeper? Chef, show the cord keeper, oh, will yeah. you? The cord keeper's on the back there. So you can just go ahead and let me just go and undo that one like that. And then you just... So you can keep it as long or as short as you like, and it goes all the way out. So it's a really nice whoop. Can you see that? <laughs> it's a long cord, <laughs> but of course, we've built in that little keeper, so you can just keep it nice and tucked away when you want it to be. Okay, guys, um, if you want the black red, again, that's the one Chef was just had his hands on. We're down to the final 200. We're going to be saying goodbye to this one. If you want the black gold, I, can we look at the gold clothes? Huh? Just because it's my <laughs> personal favorite, because it reminds me of jewelry, right? Or a phone, right? Look how pretty that is. Isn't that gorgeous? And it really is a metallic -y gold. There is um, 300 left here. So uh, the red's going to be totally sold out in just a second this won't make it till the next airing which is next hour so we honestly are just quite frankly starting to get limited because obviously we've sold a ton of them and the day is kind of winding up uh, or winding down actually Please remember, you're getting a two-pack. I want to mention one other thing. If you pull out your HSN card, we've got a special VIP event going on. When you spend $75 or more, we're going to immediately take $15 off. And you can do that as many times a day as you want, but it ends tonight at midnight. Also, if you're just a, you don't have our card and you spend $75 every single day, all day long, everything switches to free shipping. So maybe you bought something for $25 earlier and you're like, oh, I'm paying for shipping. Once you hit to $75 total and you just go ahead 
and check out. Our systems will correct everything so you get free shipping at the end of the day on everything you bought. So this to me is a perfect example. You get a couple sets of these, maybe you picked up that unbelievable pan offer, you're in and now everything you bought all day ships absolutely free and that's a lot of savings. But this is all about making food fun and fast with very little effort but it just makes you smile. I can't wait. Every time Chef pulls something new out, I'm like waiting to see when he cuts it how it looks. Like you want your food to be fun. You want people to smile. You want to have a good time in the kitchen whether it's just by yourself, your partner or you're having the whole gang over for the football party. This instantly says yeah this is a fun household and you know what chef too it's delicious and it's easy i love the fact it couldn't be simpler it's so simple i mean look i've done a little stack of chocolate cake waffles and yes that means a chocolate cake batter and then what i do is i go ahead and i hit the uh the cream on top let me get a few a little handful of these raspberries out i just pop those raspberries into it just like that and then i pour a little chocolate syrup over the top this is a little chocolate drizzle and you can see i mean imagine doing this for the next cake um, that, that someone in your family is going to have for a birthday or a little celebration or a showstopper dessert i mean just wonderful delicious fantastic and all i've done is made a few chocolate waffles I've laid it up with a little cream there and then that beautiful syrup. I mean, guys, That's ridiculous. don't sleep on it. We are getting real close <laughs> to our up. final quantity. Here. That is totally ridiculous. That is wrong <laughs> on every level could possibly oh, be Oh, you know you want it, Susan. Don't oh, you know I do. Yes, yes, clearly I do. <laughs> I am literally salivating I'm like, oh, if they could just bring me a piece of that, I'd be so darn happy. All right, guys, we're going to wrap it up for now. Now, remember, just order it now. That's my best advice because next hour, I'm Unfortunately, a couple of these are going to be missing and we just get busier and busier. It's such a good gift idea. And you know what? Maybe you tuck it away for a birthday for somebody next year. Who cares? I mean, you get two for uh, you know under 40 bucks. It's just a really neat idea. Hey, by the way, uh, my son has gotten really into fancy, fancy teas and um, he needed an electric uh, glass kettle. He wanted a glass kettle and I didn't, the chef didn't have it in stock and my son got it as a birthday gift from somebody else. But it's really amazing. He went on and on about how great it is to have a glass glass kettle because it really heats up quick. It gives you kind of the perfect temperature every time. So if you're in a hurry, you're doing your teas, you're doing your coffees, whatever it might be, this is a great kettle and it's on sale today. And please read the reviews. It is yet another customer pick. And you can also find a ton more appliances from Chef on HSN.com. Please take a moment to just look at all the customer picks because typically when he makes it, it very quickly becomes a customer pick. And I think this waffle maker set will be that exact same thing. I think you guys are going to just go crazy over it. All right, coming up next, oh my goodness, we have something special. So stay right there. You love to gift. We've got you covered during HSN's Gift List Weekend. 48 hours of amazing gifts in cozy clothing, beauty, electronics, and more. Gift List Weekend, December 10th and 11th. Stock up on everything you need to find your Mary. From festive holiday decor to great gifts. And get free shipping when you spend $75. Visit hsn.com for full details. Want to find your Mary? Shop HSN. <laughs> hey, you're watching HSN. I'm Suzanne Renny and I'm teasing the crew around me. They're so much fun. Happy holidays.
holidays. And you know, the holidays just, they're not the holidays and yet unless you're, you're in the kitchen, you're having some fun, maybe it's with friends, family, on your own. And I think Chef Curtis Stone just brings that fun to our lives with his amazing products. But what he did a couple years ago is because he is, it actually started out basically as a butcher, uh, he decided he was gonna start bringing amazing food to HSN. And ever since he's done that, oh my gosh, it has been wildly popular. And today I think we're doing kind of the king of all beef. And that's gonna be your prime rib. I mean, there is nothing in my mind better than a delicious prime rib. And Chef only brings in the best of the best. His most recent restaurant he opened in LA is a butcher shop. It's a really high-end butcher shop. So he knows where to get the sources. We just don't have to pay the prices as they do when they walk into the LA store. So here we go on. We get a four and a half pound Aussie prime rib. You're gonna get the signature butter to go with it. That's included. All of that on sale tonight for $149.95 and three flex pays. And because it's over $75, you do get free shipping. Now, this is a little strange, but we launched this a couple months ago and we give you two ship windows. You can ship right now, which will arrive at your house on December 13th, or you can choose the December ship, which will arrive on your house three days later. So you pick. <laughs> the 13th or the 16th <laughs> as your arrival dates. Either way, it's gonna be delicious. So chef, I kind of went on about your restaurant and your butcher shop and all that, but you really uh. did start out as a butcher. I sure did. I, I started my apprenticeship as a butcher and then eventually started cooking. I love them both equally. I'm literally standing above my butcher shop, Gwen, right now. Now, my favorite steak is the ribeye. And a prime rib is the primal that we cut ribeye steaks from. So if I was to take this beautiful big prime rib and cut it across like this, I'd end up with all of these different ribeyes. So this is the most beautiful roast you could imagine. The only way I could think of enhancing it is with a flavored butter. This is my gorgeous flavored garlic butter. I'm giving you a full pound of it because I tell you what, you won't just want to use it on your roast beef. You'll also want to use it in things like this. This gorgeous little uh, loaf of, um, of garlic bread that I've done here. And you can see the flavor that you're going to get in that beautiful garlic bread. So that's really fabulous. Even my mashed potatoes right here, I've gone ahead and put a little dollop of that butter on your mashed potatoes. And that's another fantastic way. All right. All you're going to do is take yourself some of that butter. You're going to spread it over the top. I know this looks in incredibly indulgent, but what's happening, because we've trimmed a lot of the fat yeah. off the beef, what happens with that butter is it now just bastes that ribeye as you, or that prime rib as you are roasting it in the oven. That's probably enough, right? Just like that. You stick it in an oven, nice and hot. We give you all of the instructions and check it out. This is it, my friends. Oh, <laughs> the happiest holiday you've ever had. Okay, here's what happens next. You go ahead, you take it out of that low wall pan, that's what we roasted it in, and then you're gonna go ahead and carve. I'm using my beautiful big fork here, it's called the turkey lifters. You ready for this? I'm gonna go in with my cordless electric knife, another incredible product that we have for you. By the way, because of the lack of cord, it means that you can use it in the dining room, you can carve um, all over the place, um, even outside if you wanna um, use the grill. By the way, there's a little safety on the top that you press to make sure. Oh yeah, look how juicy this beef is. Mm. I mean, you can slice it as thick or as thin as you like. I'm gonna lift it up. Look, first of all, at the juiciness on that beef. I mean, are you joking me? It is just so succulent. The flavor of this is unbelievable. You can cook it well done. You can cook it medium well. The choice is yours. But of course, the beautiful thing is how simple, succulent, pure in flavor. This is grass-fed beef, Susan, and the oh, reason chef. I'm saying that, <laughs> yeah, I mean, are you kidding? Can, can I how tell good you, is it? Chef, I literally had a piece in front of me and I'm halfway through it. Literally already halfway <laughs> through it. And guess what? I took a head start, Chef. I'm a little ahead of you. Mm. We have coming up his wine yeah. selection. I'm at a Chef, amazing Aussie beefs, the whole thing. We've got shrimps coming up next hour, the whole thing. And we've got the wine, and we have the wine all on sale, and it's six pack or 12 pack. And if you trust Chef for his cookware, trust him for his food, his meats, and his wines, because it is unbelievable. And we will get to this. But I gotta tell you, Chef, the combination, I should probably be drinking a red with this, but who cares? Mm -hmm. This. This is so delicious. It's so tender, and it's got so much beautiful flavor to it. It really does, mm. and that's because of that. Now you're seeing it a little more done, but look how juicy it still is, even when it's um, medium or medium well. 
By the way, you mentioned the wines. I'm going straight in for the Cabernet Sauvignon, which is what we have. We have a beautiful red blend, the Cabernet Sav, the Chardonnay, and the Pinot. We're going to do a little presentation. Wine's mm. so good. It's on sale. Oh, happy holidays. With the roast beef, that Cabernet. Mm. Mm -hmm. Wow. It mm. is so, so tasty. Now, no added hormones, no antibiotics. That's the most important thing. You need to know where your food comes from. These are cattle that roam free. Australia is one of the leaders in grass-fed beef production. We'll show you one of the farms in just a moment, but I'm gonna go ahead, pick up another one of these standing rooms. Oh, there we are. So that's me in Australia. I always go and meet the farmers that we work with because I think it's really important to, for me to understand exactly where I'm getting my beef from, for my butcher shop, for my steakhouse, for my restaurant, uh, Michelin starred restaurant, Maud. And of course, to bring the same offer to you guys, same quality that you would be getting if you came to dine in one of my restaurants. I think that's pretty fabulous as well. And here it is. I mean, look, I know you can probably find a cheaper product on the market, but do me this. Go and ask them, is it grass-fed? Is it hormone? Does it have any added hormones? The answer might be yes. And then if I was you, I would choose no thank you. Um, is it GMO-free? Go ahead and ask all of these questions of where you buy your meat from. Is it as juicy and succulent and fantastic as this? I dare say um, the answer might be no. That electric knife, by the way, it just glides through. I'm not putting any pressure. You see, I'm not sawing away. I'm just literally gently pushing down and it just yields absolutely You know what, Chef? Perfect. I might get that electric knife. My husband hacked our turkey so bad. We went to our friend's house and we had Thanksgiving, then we had a second turkey the next day and there it was all just cut beautifully and my husband like, oh, this turkey's so good. We get home the next day, he literally butchered the turkey. I have to, I'm gonna buy that, that electric <laughs> knife for him. Cause you know what, it's, it's got a lot That's of power a for, not, for not, is it rechargeable or batteries? It's, it's rechargeable, so you go ahead and charge it, and then Brilliant. it'll give you over an hour of slicing time, which is way more than you need. By the way, you guys, I'll give you a little update on this low-walled pan set. This was the 13, the 10, and the 8-inch. There's like 100 of them to go around, so if you want it, go ahead and jump on the phone right now, but we're very, very busy, so you might want to skip the line and go to hsn.com. And here it is, so let me give you an update. We have 450 left. You're getting all three, oh, it's in the class. Yeah, we have a few more, but you know what, Chef, no worries. We know we're not even doing a full presentation, you guys. So again, you're getting all three. It comes out to, what, a little over $10, what, three and a, what, $13 a pan? I don't know, my math stinks. But I don't know, around 13 bucks a pan. It's got his five layers of his Duro nonstick, which is the best of the best. It's not gonna scrape off. And it's funny when people ask me, hey, you know, you work at HSN, I need some new pans, I say, go read the reviews on Curtis Stone's. I said, his are the very best. They're the highest review. They're always the most popular. They, I have my Curtis Stone pans, and I l absolutely love them, and I recommend them. But the only color I have left right now is going to be the classic blue, and I have about 400 left. We're not going to do a full look. This is the whole scoop, because they are almost completely sold out. And Chef, just give us a couple of seconds on why you did this design, because I thought this was really unique. Right, well, I made the eight inch a little deeper in terms of its side so that you can have sauces. You can do a little stir fry in the eight inch. The 10 inch and the 13 inch, you'll notice it has a really low wall. The 13 inch, the lowest, because if you want to do pancakes and if you want to do French toast, now you can get in under there with your spatula very, very easily. They're really lightweight. There's five layers of Durapan in every single one. And for this set of three, each one of these is costing about 13 bucks for you to get it home on free shipping and handling. It's crazy. I've never done a deal this good before. There's a couple of hundred of you left that can get it, but go ahead, enjoy these pans. If you go to pick this up and it's sold out, we do have other sets. So go to hsn.com and shop my whole collection. You're gonna love what you find. And speak of it, there it is. You can see he's got a lot of special videos actually that are really, really fun. And you can see his entire collection, even that great carving knife. How clever, of course, you recharge it. I kept thinking, oh, it's gonna be battery operated. He's like, no, nope, recharge, yep. He thought, of that. The he thought of everything. All right, uh, guys, ben. so let me give you a peek at what's coming up this hour. Well, clearly, I've already talked about the wine. I will tell you, this is one of the best 
wine values that I've seen almost anywhere. You know, and I shop for a lot of wines as gifts and all that kind of good stuff. You guys are not gonna believe what we have coming up. But we all, and here it is. So you're gonna get your choice of a six pack or a 12 pack. And we have a whole bunch of different choices. You can do a combo. We have this, we have that. We'll get into that in just a second. They all come with gift bags on top of it. Now take a moment, look at 12 bottles of some of the best wine you'll ever drink. It's absolutely delicious. And if you love Chef Curtis Stone, you're gonna trust his opinion. He's not going to